Hey everyone, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you guys can't miss any of our upcoming dubs. Hope you enjoy. Oh my god, what's taking them so long? <laughs> Is your schedule that packed? We're making dinner tonight. You can join if you hold your fucking horses. I thought Artemis didn't like guys at her house. <laughs> ah, I think she's a little distracted today. Really? But why? She lost her new roommate at the party last night. Apparently, she spent the night with Hades. Who's the new roommate? What was it? Uh, some flower goddess? I don't know. She's new. Do you mean Persephone? That's it. You know her? A little bit. Mainly for work. Demeter sends her a lot of letters. Oh, they're coming. Dude! She is hot! Why didn't you say anything? <laughs> you are such a pain in the ass. Stay in the car. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> huh? Hermes! I hardly recognized you. You look so handsome dressed this way. <laughs> I heard you survived a brush with Hades. Amazing! Um. <laughs> oh! I finally got a phone! You have to give me your number. <laughs> Hey, now how come this guy gets all the compliments and attention? Persephone, this is my brother. Apollo. <laughs> hmm. What was it like, anyway? I've never been to the underworld myself. It's beautiful. It's nothing like the stories. Hades has this amazing house. Yeah? I've seen it from the outside. And he has all these books, and, and all these dogs? And he gave me this beautiful fur coat, and- No, he was only being nice so he can get in your pants, right? Apollo! <laughs> oh, no. That's not true. He, he's- he's my friend. Come on, man. She had a good time. Just leave it. No, I'm being realistic. I know, but she's a kid. Go easy. Stop! talking about me like I'm not here. <laughs> Whoops. We're here. You guys can stop now. <sighs> Come on, Artie. Don't give me the stink eye. <sighs> Let me help you with that. No, thanks. I thought we weren't allowed men in the house. Persephone, he's my brother. Come on. <sighs> Sorry. I think I'm just a little overtired from the night before. I'm sorry he's being weird. He's just trying to look out for you in his own way. Poof! I could make something for dinner using the crock pot if you want. Really? If I put something on now, it should be ready by dinner. We could play cards and watch a movie later on or something. <laughs> she can't stand you. I've never seen her so worked up. What kind of an outfit is that? I could see your Dan belly button. <sighs> Maybe you should cover it up. I can see your stupid face! Maybe you should cover up! <laughs> Got him. Stop annoying my friend! You're so embarrassing! <laughs> Percy? What's the matter? I... I slipped with the knife! Uh, how bad is it? There... there's a lot of blood. Do you have a first aid kit? It's been ages since I needed one. I can't remember... Hermes, help me find it. So, 
go into your room and touch all your things? What? Uh, no! Okay, I'm going into your room to touch all your things! Don't go in my room! I have to deal with this. Can you make sure Persephone is okay? Sure thing. What are you doing? It's no good if you get cold. Hey! Stop that! Would you just let me help you? You really don't like me. Do you? D do we have to do this now? Might as well distract you from the pain. Huh? I made a terrible impression. Can we... I want to start over. I know sometimes I can be a little... Mean? I was going to say abrasive, but fine. <laughs> it hurts! There's a lot of blood, but I doubt you'll need stitches. I'll keep pressure on it. Look, I work a lot of really long hours pulling the sun around the mortal realm. And sometimes I don't have great control over my mood. I got frustrated because you don't seem to realize that you're in a lot of danger. Hades could have kept you in the underworld forever if he wanted to. This wouldn't have happened if I'd been at that party. Apollo, I know that I'm relatively young in comparison to everyone else, but I still have to be responsible for myself. I shouldn't have to be watched. Hey guys, I found the... Kit? Uh. Hey, kids, I hope I'm not interrupting. Not at all! Yes. Uh, uh. <laughs> Blink twice if you're in trouble. Nudge, nudge. Give me that. Let's see. Um. Here it is. Huh? There. Fixed. It's healed. Not even a mark. I guess Apollo's kinda cute. If I squint. Cute, but annoying. Very annoying. That actually feels way better! Thanks. Well, medicine is my specialty after all. I guess you're not so useless after all. Boop! So, you're not still pissed off with me? Yeah, we're good. Great! Hey! Hmm? Take our picture! Uh, hey! Whoa, Persephone, you look so comfortable! <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> Did you find the first aid kit? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Still no reply. Maybe Apollo was right? And Artemis said that stuff before, too. Phew! Those kings will screw anything with a heartbeat. Why does my chest hurt? Do they have a point? All I ever hear about is Zeus and Poseidon's escapades. Is Hades the same? <laughs> he didn't seem that way. I'd be lying if I didn't find the attention exciting. I like the way I feel when he looks at me. So unrealistic. I shouldn't be thinking about this sort of stuff in the first place. Artemis and the other girls would be furious if they found out. It was so refreshing not to be treated like a child for once. Why would he be interested in knowing me? Just a minor goddess with a role of little to no impact. <sighs> Everything is set out already for the rest of eternity. At least I can pick my own bedtime. I'm gonna turn in. Night, everyone. Night, Percy. Night. We better wrap this up. I've got work in the mortal realm soon anyway. You guys can watch the rest of the movie if you want. Just let yourself out.
Hey guys, this episode of Laura Olympus contains themes of sexual trauma that may be upsetting for some readers. This is where that PG-13 warning comes in. This is the last episode in the parts, so if you want to skip it, feel free, it's completely fine. And if you're not skipping it and you want to finish the part, let's go. <sighs> Persephone. Percy. Uh, Apollo? What's the matter? What time is it? I came to see you, silly. Huh? I've been waiting all day for this. Uh. Mm. Apollo, I I'm, I'm flattered, but... I can't really do this sort of thing. You've been flirting with me all day, Persephone. Don't act like you don't want this. <sighs> Did I? Do I like this? I can't think properly. You know I'm in training to be a sacred virgin like Artemis, Athena, and Hestia, right? That's the only reason my mother let me come here. I'm... I'm going to live a modest life in service to others. Surely you can make an exception for someone as grand as myself. That's not really how being a virgin for all eternity works. All eternity. That's the first time I've said it out loud. I hate the way those words sound coming out of my mouth. I feel so confused. A door? This wasn't here before. This choice could be my own. It feels ugly. But at least, it will be mine. Come on, Percy. I thought you were more mature than this. Okay. Okay. Someone's very distressed. I can feel it. I wonder who it is. Wait. This is happening really fast. Why did I agree to this? I don't want to do this anymore. I want to stop. Is it too late to say something? Huh? What are you doing? I'm just taking pictures. Relax. Uh oh, okay. Is this normal? Is this what it should be like? This is nothing like what I've read. I don't see what all the fuss is about. It just hurts. I'm going to stay here, where it's safe, until he's finished. Don't let him see you cry. Hey. Hey! Huh? Overwhelmed, huh? Understandable. I have that effect on people. I better get going. You're just... J just gonna leave? I've gotta get ready for work. Now remember, just keep this between you and me. You're my girl, okay? <laughs> Your hair looks good. You should keep it that way. <laughs> I still look the same. I don't think the others will be able to tell. Don't you dare contact your mother! You'll make her more worried than she needs to be.
damn it. I, I don't know what you can do with that one, but you can put it in if you find the place. Looking good now, nothing's gonna get in the way. We're halfway there, we're looking back now. I never thought that I'd ever say. <laughs> okay, I'm going to your room to touch all your things. <laughs> I like this guy already. Arrows had to cry, now I have to cry. Oh no, here we go. He looks so derpy in that, oh my god. <laughs> mm. Holy fuck, your voice deepened right there. <laughs> it sounded like, like, cause of the freaking mic cut, it made your voice so much deeper. Hey guys, I found the... kit? Oh, maybe I should see what I'm looking at. Maybe Apollo was right? I feel like I've said this before. Oh, maybe Mom was right? That's where it came from. Whoa, Persephone, you look so comfortable. Like, on a scale of 1 to 10, how sarcastic should I be right now? Okay, so I was looking up how to pronounce the word escapade just to make sure I was saying it right. And Google, with their cleverness... <laughs> escapade. Why does she sound like that? It sounds really creepy and seductive. I don't like it. Hang on. Hang on, this is what you're... All right, guys, just give us about 15 more minutes, and I'll be ready to turn myself in. Don't worry. <sighs> Sorry. I think I'm just a little overtired from the night before. From the night before. From the night before. From the night before! Oh, gosh. Oh, I'm actually yawning. <laughs> hey, guys. This episode of Laura Olympus contains themes of sexual trauma that may be upsetting for some reason. Reasers. Yep. You all are reasers. We did it! <laughs> We're finally done! Woo!